Mr. Shine. Mr. Shine. Mr. Shine. Mr. Shine. Hello and welcome back. It's Mr. Shine once again. We are we are moving forward, one and one with this warlock deck. Uh, I, it came down to some late game heroics again. I feel like the last few runs, well, both the Paladin run, most of the games that I played with the Paladin deck, and so far, the Warlock one ones have come down right to the end. And I'm trying to think of what I am missing. Probably missing a few things. I feel like my game has not been quite as crisp as it sometimes it can be. But, well, we'll see. We'll see if I can shape up, shape up or ship out right here. That's not too bad of a start. Definitely don't want that. I have better threes. I have a lot of threes in this deck, so I will find a different one. I like having that worgen though, right away. There we go. This is a nice curve, and it has a very strong three. Unfortunately, well, two threes, not fantastic, but not the worst. Siete dos. Oh, I have a nice Twilight Drake here. That'll be nice. Ah, here we go. This is where it all changes. Excellent. My Worgen gets his value, even though that's not a good 2-drop. It's still... It is certainly worth it. I think it is certainly worth me killing and not being greedy. Yes. And so now I have the option if I want to play my Harvest Golem, or if I want to um, boost right up to the Twilight Drake. That'll be nice. I think with that, it's not a particularly scary card in my harvest. If he wants, if he wants to hit and use a trade, um, he spends more mana to kill it. My harvest can still get the kill on it. I think I do not bring Twilight Drake out quite yet. Because this golem will do fine. It's nice to get the golem down to 1 HP, or just in terms of, you know, it, it kills something and then it uh, still needs to be hit a few times. Alright, so yeah, so that's pretty slow. And I will definitely do that trade here. I will bring out the Twilight Drake. I don't think I want to use my Soul Fire here. So my Drake is still plenty strong, even if it does take that. I'm staying on curve, I like that. I also like the fact that I could use the coin to maybe get an early Sea Giant. One shot, one. Good use. But he's still playing fairly slow here. You love my new kind of surprised. Well, okay, whatever. Alright, so now... I think I coin the Sea Giant, don't I? I think I coin the Sea Giant, and I kill this. This is left with 3 HP, which can be killed by a few things. But... Especially against druids that don't have that many answers. I think this is just worthwhile to do. And I could even... I guess if I wanted to, I could soul fire to kill that, so it could not kill my twilight. But that might be better saved. The other options are... Bring both these out. You can clear this. You can bring this out and kill this. That... <laughs> that actually might be a little bit better simply because then he has no ability to clear either my Worgen or my Twilight Drake. I'm going to do that. I'm not going to use the Soul Fire here. It is also, I mean, uh, was that a mistake? Maybe. But it also preserves this. That's kind of strange. 
That's very strange. All right. So to kill that, I use this first and risk losing the sea giant. I would like to have some board. I think I'm going to tap first because I want to keep the sea giant if I can. Yeah, I want to keep board here. <laughs> there goes the sea giant again. Man, that sea giant just does not want to stay in this game. Like, See you later, suckers. I'm out of here. Just in time for him to drop his 510 taunt, right? Bring me steel. Oh, this could be nice. Oh, that's right. It'll buff that. Well, I can silence it. Okay, this could be real angry. Get ready for this. Do I win? 4, 8, 11, 16, 17 if I buff that with this. Oh, well, I will definitely, I will clear his board then. So I will silence this, I will make this angry, I will clear this, I will hit him in the face. I have enough to kill him right now. I am not even going to add more to the board, I don't think. He does have his 8. If he drops his 8, he's still dead. I trade these two in and hit him. These are those times where... Well, what could he do? What could he do to kill this, actually? And now do I just hit him in the face? I need to get around something. Wow. Wow. Wow, wow, wee wow. You are kidding, right? You really are kidding, right? I mean... That was literally the worst case scenario. The top decks of mind control deck steals my spell damage and wipes my board with a starfall. All for 8 mana. I'm glad I have this on video, because that was just amazing and I could lose this game now. Especially if he has a big taunt. Wow, and that was a 1 in... Oh my god. Wow. Gonna go on tilt, folks. Why did he heal that? That's funny. Gonna go on tilt. Uh, I don't play that right now. Okay. That was a weird thing to heal. Since it has 4 HP, I kill it anyways. I'll put it on your head. <sighs> I can't kill this because it's in taunt mode. Oh no, that's right, you can't do that. That's right. Oh boy. I cannot go on tilt. I am calm. I am serene. I think I so tap. I think I put this out here. Why would I do that, actually? So we can kill that. At the same time, getting things on the board might be nice. How do I get both of these on? He's going to feel the need. So I view this, and then he will be able to... Um, maybe I just hit this here, keep that alive. Force him to trade that. Or do I kill this right away? 
so many possible. I bring this out that he can't kill it right now. Have nine damage incoming. I would just go for the face. No, because he's gonna have to kill that anyways. I probably should have played the doggy here actually because he needs to trade into that. Well, no, because he can just hit it. If he can't kill that, it's over and he can't taunt. So it may still be over. Seriously. I kill one of them. <sighs> boy, oh boy. I use this. I probably tap. Because I can't play anything else. And do I hit him in the face? At this point, six da or seven damage coming in, eight damage to me. So I'd be at three. If I would hit him, he needs to trade both these things into it. Which he probably needs to do anyways. So, so I actually probably do this. If I do this, he trades this anyways, probably. I'm behind in terms of... I do have more cards than him. Sorry, I'm taking a long time thinking about this, I know. So many possibilities. <laughs> hmm. Wow, that one play, that mind control tech and Starfall, totally changed this game around. This was... Alright, well... <laughs> so close. So close. Oh. Um. Well played, sir. <laughs> Okay, uh, you did have 7 HP, but if you want to suicide yourself... <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, good. Serves you right, Sieti Dos. Karma comes back to get you in the end. Alright, that's really funny. Well, um, I've been Mr. Shine, and I will see you guys next time. Oh, I should also mention it before. Um, well, A... If you're enjoying this, link, um, subscribe, like, comment. I, I'm really, I mean, I've really been having a good time with this. I'm enjoying seeing seeing you guys, seeing people subscribe, and, and just hear what people have to say and try to improve my game. I will also be out of town this weekend, so I think after these videos, you may not see too much for a little bit. But I'm still here. Don't I, don't worry. I will just come back and um, probably early next week. So all right, I will talk to you later. Bye.